Hello everybody, today I would like to share with you my original meditation that I decided to call Existence Without Thinking. Until you think of yourself as body and mind, you will continue having problems. If you identify yourself with the physical reality, you identify yourself with suffering. That's how our world functions. The world that doesn't really exist, but for many seems very real. If we perceive ourselves as body-mind phenomenon, then we believe that the world is real. We will be searching for answers and while doing that, we will continue to suffer. The suffering will end only when you're awakened to the truth, the truth of your being. When you are awakened, the world doesn't change. You just see it differently. The things do not possess you any longer, or other words, the phenomenon of cause and effect ceases to exist. Try to remember that the world is just the projection of your mind. What kind of projection? It all depends on your inner perception and your inner state. We all look at the same world, but we see completely different images. What we see is our selves. Problems don't exist. The only real problem is that we allow our thoughts to travel beyond our nose. Or other words, we are not able to stay in the here and now. If you manage to catch your thoughts before they travel beyond your nose, where is the problem? The problem is only in your thought. Only in your thought. When your mind slows down, where is the problem? It doesn't exist. But if you allow your thoughts to travel beyond your nose, the problems overwhelm you. Your mind starts judging, criticizing, evaluating, and you become filled with worries and fears. Many of you will be puzzled, asking yourself, but how can you exist without thinking? No one will give you a clear answer until you try it yourself. Just take a leap of faith and try to live in the here and now and see what will happen, what will unravel in front of you. The tree doesn't have to think. The grass 
doesn't have to think. The world doesn't have to think about itself. Everything arranges itself. There is a higher force, a higher power that knows how to arrange everything. You just have to learn how to trust it. So the real question the mankind should ask is not to be or not to be, but maybe to think or not to think. Existence without thinking.